Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can set up new email account for your iPhone 13 or the iPhone 13 Pro. Now, there are two different ways how you can do this. You can directly open up the mail app on your home screen or in your app library. Okay, and in here, you can select one of the email services to sign in. You will need to have a username or an email address and a password to sign into your email account. Another way you can do it is to go into settings. So on your home screen, tap on settings and in settings, we're going to go down and tap on mail. And in here, tap on accounts and then tap on add account. Okay, so it's the same thing. And in here you can choose, for example, iCloud, Microsoft Exchange, Google, Yahoo, AOL, Outlook, and other. So if you choose other, you can add in your email account, say from a website or from a, from a uh, email services that has not been listed in the list right here. Or you can add in your PubTree account. So let's say uh, your email services is Google, so you can choose uh, Google to add in Gmail. Okay, so say here, settings, once you use your google.com to sign in, so you can tap on continued. And in here, we're going to put in the email address. Okay, so put in the email address and then tap on next. And say could not find the account, so need to correct the spelling and then tap on next okay next we need to print the password okay so once you have printed the password tap on next and if you print the wrong password you can try again okay so once you have printed the correct uh, password if you have a two-step Verifications, you will need to uh, verify it. Okay, so I have just verified my two steps authentication. And next in Gmail, you can turn on or turn off mail, contacts, calendars, and notes. Next, you can tap on the save button to save the changes. And that's it. So that's how you can add in a, an email account. Uh, to your mailbox on the iPhone uh, 13 or the iPhone 13 Pro. Now you can continue to add in to add in more email account. So tap on Add Account, and next you can choose Yahoo, iCloud, Outlook, or other. Okay, so you can do that. Now another thing that you can do is let's say if you are using uh, Gmail, you can download the native app. So you can go to App Store. So in here. We can go to App Store and instead of using the built-in uh, mail app, you can use the native app of that email services such as Gmail. And then you can just simply uh, open up Gmail and then you sign in with your Gmail account. So um, while, there is, while it is easy to use the built-in mail app, if you don't want to use the built-in, you can download a, um, a native app. And that's it. Thank you for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.